Welcome, Littles and Jelly Spoons, back to Kai Matthews' YouTube channel and another board game. I am once again joined by Mr. B from Mr. B's ukulele channel. Hello. Now I'm the king of the swingers. And, uh, what? Well, this one is your board game, uh, Mr. B, so I'm going to let you do the introduction to it. Yeah, so this is very exciting. So this is Waddington's car racing game, which is a, I sort of feel is a bit of a, uh, a, a bit of a boring description. It's much more this Waddington's Formula One racing game, which really just depicts the golden era of sort of 1960s Formula One racing uh, with all the, the beautiful uh, cars of the time. These lovely little plastic models. Really great, simple, very simple board, uh, but very effective. And actually some really nice, simple, but thoughtful rules that allow for quite a lot of gameplay, quite a lot of strategy, don't they? Mm. And um, so in a nutshell, movement is depicted by speed. So we have each car, uh, we're going to have two cars each because it really works well with a three to six player game. It's one of those games that it does work with two players. So we're going to go for two cars each to spice it up a little bit so you've got a little bit more strategy. So we're going to have two of these uh, steering wheels each and each one depicts one of your cars and what's happening to that car. And each 20 mile an hour um, block of speed uh, equates to one space on the board and you can accelerate by up to 60 miles an hour in one turn. Corners have speed limits on them. 80, 60, 40, I think 40 is the slowest ones. Over here there's a couple of high speed corners, 120 and 100, but mainly you, you talk about 80 or 60 miles an hour limits on going around the corners. Now, so you have to break to within certain speeds of those limits. Now if you break to the, the limit of the corner and you go around an 80 mile an hour corner at 80 miles an hour, then that's absolutely fine. Obviously it is supposed to be a race, we're trying to win, so you're gonna go faster than that. And at that point, this brings in the dice. Now you don't use the dice to move, but you use the dice to check your penalties when you choose to move faster than is safe on a corner. And so really it's just a case of getting to each corner as quickly as you can, managing your speeds around those corners, watching your brake and tyre wear, and, uh, and really just trying to stay in front, but also try and stay alongside the other drivers. We've also got some bonus cards. Uh, I won't say what they are, but we've got five green bonus cards each to begin with. These are all enhancements to help us in the game, and we can use these tactic cards at any moment, mainly at the end of our turn. So this one says, superb driving, take one corner at any speed. Speed gain by slipstreaming, move three spaces forward, and, and things like that. So we'll, we'll see those come into play as we play the game. And the second set is the orange set of pit cards. So if you pit, you have to choose, you have to work your speed, so you land in your pit box. Now these are quite a lottery. Most of them say something along the lines of, faulty tires fitted, miss a turn. Good pit work, but slow start. Starting speed 40, but do not miss a move. So that's about as good as it gets. And that is about it. So the rules are relatively straightforward to get your heads around. And we've got two cars each. So what colours have you gone for? Right, I have gone for uh, red and green. Uh, so on. technically, it could be Team Lotus, the greens, and uh, a bit of Ferrari there in red. Okay. And I've gone for uh, orange and blue. So I'm going to say that's um, McLaren in orange and uh, Team Williams in blue, I think. Mm -hmm. Now, just having a quick recap of the rules, is you're supposed to actually roll the dice, and whoever gets the highest number gets mm -hmm. the first slot on the car, and presumably yeah. then goes first. Yeah. But we always just choose our own colours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, So, interestingly, I'm orange, which is number two, mm -hmm. you're then three and four, green and red, yeah. and I'm then number six, blue. Yeah. So, if we played in that order, that would probably balance out, unless you want to do it differently. No, you can do it. Uh, that that's me going first, yeah. you going second and third, yeah. and me going last. So yeah. essentially my first car gets a bit of an advantage, mm -hmm. and my last car will be at a disadvantage there, and your, yours are quite nicely spaced in the middle. So do you want to see how that Yep, yeah, let's see how that plays out. Probably makes sense to do it like that. Mm -hmm. So um, two lap race, so you set, you've even got a lap indicator, mm -hmm. we can set that to two. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm going to, first car, it's going to be just moved to 60, 20, 40, 6, that's three spaces, and I'm off. Okay, yeah, over to you, Matthew. So it's your yeah, Lotus, you green yeah. car. I mean, it's fairly similar stuff. So uh, green straight into 60 also. So that's three, first, three spaces. First couple of terms, yes, it is. They're going to be very straightforward. Yeah, do the same. Same on your Ferrari. All right, yeah. And, then, yeah. and my Williams as well. One, two, three. Okay. Except straight away, we can see the track narrow. So it's only wide enough for six at the start. Mm -hmm. So if you play it with a six player game, it does get very interesting. Yeah. But obviously, it just takes longer to play through the game. Mm -hmm. uh, I was back to the McLaren. I'm going to accelerate up to 120. It's a full six spaces. One, two, three, four, five, six. 
and you can see straight away I'm now into a pass the track with only three lanes so um, it's going to get tricky for my Williams in a minute I think. Okay. Over to you. So yeah I'm going to do a similar, accelerate to 120 and go for... It's going to move him alongside. Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then you've got yeah. two choices for your Ferrari, you either yeah. pull up one space behind mm. so straight away you've lost the space or you go down the inside line, but that's got a 40 mile an hour limit, so exactly. the maximum you can do there would be 80, otherwise you'd spin yep. off automatically. Uh, well, I'm going to go for, for 80, so that only gives me four spaces. But that does give me the chance to get ahead of you yeah. with the Williams. Uh, one, two, three, four. Okay. okay. So I'm going to come in at, uh, let me see, 24, 60, 80. What I could do here is I could block Matthew uh, with my blue car, but then I'd be travelling far too fast for that corner. So I'm not going to do that. Um, I think the best thing for me, bear in mind I am last, I'm not going to actually be blocked because the other cars will move out of the way. So I'm going to go 20, 40, 60, 80, 100 and just sit on the outside there behind the McLaren, the orange car, and um, ready to follow through the corner basically. Okay. <coughs> it's back to you. It's back to me, sorry, yes, so still on the McLaren, travelling too fast now for the corner. Um, now you can break up to 20 miles an hour, which is one space on the chart, um, for free. Anything beyond that, you start getting tyre and brake wear. So I'm going to just utilise that, I'm going to brake to 100, which means I'm only going to go around this corner at 20 miles an hour over the speed limit. Mm. So it's going to be 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Now I have to roll the dice. And on this chart it says plus 20 and plus 40, so if I get a plus 40 only I'll be fine. If it's a plus 20 and plus 40 I'll have to take that damage. So I roll 4 and a 1, which is obviously 5, but it says plus 20 or 40, tyre wear 1. So that's not too bad, but uh, it's early days so that's a bit of damage straight away on the tyres. Um, over to your Lotus. Uh, uh, yeah. Lotus. Okay, so probably going to do a similar thing actually, so I'll just go to 100, which gives me how many spaces? Five. Five, yes. yes. Uh, and go one, two, three, four, five. And then all the dice as well. Open to six. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, six would be a plus 40 only. Three and three is no penalty at all. Uh, you got nine. nine. Ah, Plus no, 40, yeah. tie wear one, break wear one, but no damage for you because you yeah. only went over at 20 yeah. extra. So it's down to the Ferrari now. Okay, he is. Uh, We've got a clear track, really. Yeah. One, two, three. So, one, two, three, four. There you go. You're going to stay at 80, keep it safe. Yep. Keep it safe. Ooh, see Matthew straight away got strategic there. <laughs> and uh, see what it's, about, it's about as strategic as I'm going to get the entire game. What so. he's actually done is sat on the 80 corner, mm. uh, and on the inside of that is a 60 limit. So I can't, I can't actually go around that corner 80. Um, I'm, I'm travelling at 100, uh, so he's really done me in there straight away for the poor guy in the Williams. If I break to 80, which I can do for free, I can go over the 61. 20, 40, 60. So I'm actually pulling ahead of space, but I'm going to take more damage than I needed to. So that was quite quite tricky there for Matthew. Let's see what I get. Could go wrong here. Nine. Okay, same as you got. That's a plus 40 yeah. damage only. Uh, so I'm, I'm clear. So that uh, I got away with that, but that was tricky. Tricky. Okay. Right, back to the uh, McLaren. I'm travelling at 100. I'm approaching the second corner. 100 would take me onto the corner. If I break to 80, which is the speed of the corner, I don't actually get to the corner. So that, sometimes that's the really annoying bit, you yeah. want to slow down, but then you've got to sort of waste the turn. Mm. I'm going to stay at 100, I don't want to chance it too much. Um, so that's 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, job done. I'm on the corner, I'm looking for a plus 40 Six. only. Yes, yeah, so yeah. plus 40 only, no damage. I'm doing alright, the McLaren is looking good. Okay, this Your is uh, Lotus, the green. Yeah, again, pretty similar tactic actually. Yes, yeah, so one, two, three, four, five, hitting on the on the eighty. And go in there. Take again. a roll. Oh, yeah. Three. Oh dear. Uh, three is spin off. Oh, this could be game changing very early on. It's a plus 20, plus 40 spin off, but do not alter gauges, which means um, you don't alter the tyre or brake weight. It doesn't take anywhere, but obviously his speed is now zero, so you yep. need to reduce your yeah. speed to zero. Yeah, yeah. Next turn, you're only going to move three spaces. Yeah. 
Uh, by the way, in honour of your little green lotus, I've got a, a nice lotus uh, John Player special here. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's, it's, it's model. It's not a scale electric car. Oh no, it's a, it's a proper model. It's is a, it? Um, um, it is a uh, Corgi Toys. Yeah, nice. Corgi Toys Whiz Wheels John Player special. Uh, it doesn't have a date on it, but um, yeah, scale one to thirty-six. It's yeah. quite a nice toy that. Mm -hmm. There we go. Right. Um, so it's down to. Have you had the Ferrari? Oh no, yeah, so I need to go to, uh, for the Ferrari. So it is going to go up to. It needs to make up some ground here for the team, I feel. Yes, yeah, so you can go up. You can go up 40, can't you, for free? Yeah. yeah. You can go up to 60, because you've got quite a bit of space there for the corner. Obviously, you've got to break uh, yeah. for the corner. The so that's, but that's only six spaces. So one, oops, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, that's a good position. Yep. Uh, I think I will also. I'm going to go up to 100. Mm -hmm. I'm taking it a little bit cautiously with the Williams, seeing what happens. One, two, three, four, five. Pulls me alongside you. Okay. But I'm in good shape for that next corner. Okay, back to your. Yep, back to the McLaren. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to risk it here because if I get over that corner on my next turn, I can then accelerate up into and away. Mm. Whereas if I, if I don't get to the corner, I'm still limited by the corner of the following turn. So I'm going to slightly push myself here. I've gone to 120, which is 40 over. So that takes me from 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120. I'm on the corner, which means next turn I can go flat out. But it does mean I'm plus 40 here, so there's a bit of a risk. And it's 9, which is plus 40, tie wear 1, break wear 1. So I am incurring increasing damage already. But obviously, with you spun off, that mm -hmm. does put me in a nice lead. It does indeed. But your car is in much better condition already than mine, despite yeah. having crashed. Yeah. But uh, that's the way the game works. It's uh, it is it, yeah. It sort of mitigates it slightly. You spin off, which is quite a bad thing. But you don't actually get damage, so it sort of helps you later on. Okay. Probably got to look at these as well. Yeah, I, I have a look at these. Should I share with the camera what I've got? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not a shot. There we go. That's a shot. So I'll, show you, I'll show you that you can do a freeze frame. Yeah. The, the other camera viewer is going to be thinking, what's he doing? I can't, that, that's not very good. Right. Nice. 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 Uh, right, so yes, I'm obviously going to accelerate to 60, uh, but then also play a tactics, tactic card of slipstreaming and moving forward at three spaces. Okay, so is that the green car you lotus? Yeah. There. Just in case anyone wondered what it said, it's not at all going to be a pain in the ass for editing when I have to <laughs> flip them over. Uh, okay, so that's three spaces, so one, two, three. Plus your three. Oh, now that's clever, you can go down the inside yeah, track. One, two, three. Now that's a good comeback, that's a really good comeback. Yeah. That's nice. Yeah. Uh, okay, as for my Ferrari, bless it, uh, we're going to go down to 100 I think. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five. Pop me there. I'm gonna do exactly the same on the uh, Williams. I'll let you do the dice roll. Eleven. Eleven. Oh, it is a twenty. Oh no, again. Oh, spin, spin off. off. And uh, so do I spin off backwards or I'm do I spin, you spin yeah, off here? Yeah, okay, that's that's bad luck. Yeah. That's really unfortunate. Um, mm -hmm. I'm gonna stay on a hundred as well. Okay. Twenty four to sixty eight to a hundred. You've been very unlucky with your dice rolls, haven't uh, you? Yeah. Four. Four. Tire wear one. Yes. Okay. Luck. Back to the McLaren. Aren't so you? I'm now going to go full speed up to 160. Oh, he's going to really knock That's it out of the park. eight spaces. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And uh, over to you. Okay. The corners involved. Yes. Uh, you can get up to 120 there. Yeah, we can do. He'll be right behind me, actually. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. You've recovered from that spin very, yeah. very well. First spin, don't think I'll recover from the second spin uh, quite as well. Uh, 60, I don't think I've got any uh, tactics. Do you take it, when do you take new tactics? Cards? You don't, not, do you not? Say, no, yeah. okay. I didn't think you did. Um, uh, it's only 60. Have you got any fast acceleration ones? Um, with Mr. B pulling away to an early lead, will Kai be able to catch up and improve his dice rolls? Find out on Wednesday.
Well, ladies and jelly spoons, I hope you enjoyed that video. Thanks very much for checking it out. If you liked it, by all means, hit the old like button and show your support. And if you want to be even more supportive, you can consider checking out the rest of the channel and even possibly subscribing. And if you're watching this part of the video, I just want to say thank you once again. Your continued support means the world to me.